Welcome Joslyn Center Variety Show fans. This is Friday, um, our Friday interview show. Um, before we get to our interview with uh, Felice Chiaparini from the Desert Oasis Healthcare, there's a few uh, announcements and uh, things we'd like to cover that are coming up with the Joslyn Center. Um, we are looking at potential reopening uh, later on this year after Memorial Day. So um, check uh, your email and our calendar and our, and our social media pages. And of course, we'll be announcing it also on our variety show. So that's something exciting that's coming up. Um, also coming up on Tuesday, April 27th um, is personal protection for seniors. Uh, and that's really important because we are getting out there out in the community more um, and we want to be careful and, and learn how to protect ourselves as we're uh, out there or even if someone uh, that we don't want in our home comes into our home. So it's a great class. Uh, and that's Tuesday, April 27th at 11 a.m. Um, if you want information about that, contact Melanie our program director um, at 760-340-3220, um, and she's at extension 102. Um, also coming up, uh, we have our Aging Mastery Program with our Wellness Center. Um, that's on May 11th. Um, so um, sign up for that. That's, that's a really great class that teaches you uh, how to approach issues as you get older, such as if you're having problems with sleeping, um, exercise, fall prevention, um, relate, potential relationship issues. Um, and maybe all of us need a little bit of help on that uh, as we enter after, start entering back into the community after this year of, of isolation that we've had. Um, and then Brain Boot Camp, which is a really popular class um, that's coming up on May 12th. And 19th. So um, be sure you sign up for that. And that's with Veronica in our wellness center. And she's at um, the same number, 760-340-3220. And she's at extension 117 and can get you all the information on that. Um, we're doing a, a variety show and we're, we're watching it on Facebook. If you or anyone you know would like more information or assistance on how to deal with some of the uh, issues that we face with uh, technology, certainly um, contact Melanie again at that number I mentioned um, for our tech buddies and we'll pair you with someone that has the experience and can work with you one-on-one -on -one, uh, for increasing your uh, comfort with approaching technology. And even though we may be reopening in, a, in several weeks or a month, um, we're going to also be continuing with our virtual programming. Um, and finally, you know, some of our virtual programming also, we want to let you know, not only can you do it by video, you can participate by phone. So that's our chat group um, or our book club um, or our uh, health lectures that are coming up. So talk with Melanie. She can get you the information on how to participate in those classes. Yeah. Uh, and finally, one of our favorite, Bling and Bingo, which is on Tuesdays at 2 p.m. Uh, that's going to continue for uh, as, as we wait to reopen. So uh, if you like bingo, um, tune in on Facebook Live and you can see Bling and Bingo um, every Tuesday. So um, as I mentioned, you know, one of our biggest supporters, and we're very proud to have them, uh, work with us on, on many different um, levels in, in terms of providing um, programs and, and uh, care is the Desert Oasis um, Healthcare. And so we're going to introduce uh, Felice Chiaparini, who is a community development specialist for Desert Oasis. Um, how are you, Felice? Good morning, Jack. Thanks for having me on today. And good morning to uh, all of the Jocelyn members out there today. And so I know a lot of things are happening. Um, Desert Oasis is also is doing um, vaccination clinics throughout the valley. Um, and yep. you're also doing, you've got a new uh, uh, outreach vehicle to bring your services into the community. And so I think 
Um, we wanted to talk with you a little bit about that. Um, and I think you're going to show us some pictures of that. So I will let you go and, and you can tell us about what's happening at, at Desert Oasis Healthcare. Well, much, Jack. And uh, that was good news to hear that you'll be opening up uh, soon. I know it's been uh, a long time uh, for all of us and uh, particularly for the Jocelyn Center. Um, you guys have really been at the forefront of doing all of the virtual programming to keep uh, your members in touch and in contact and uh, sharing programs virtually. Um, your Blinging Bingo is a great program. So thank you for all that you do. And uh, you are correct. Um, Desert Oasis has been um, a proud sponsoring partner with the Jocelyn Center now for many years. And uh, we look forward to continuing our support and uh, working together. Um, I just briefly want to let those people who are not familiar with us, certainly a lot of your members are also our members as well, but uh, Desert Oasis is um, a local healthcare provider. We've been in the desert now 40 years. This is our 40th anniversary, so we're very proud of that. Um, we have over 60,000 members here in the Coachella Valley and the Morongo Basin area, and approximately 30,000 of those members are seniors uh, on Medicare Advantage plans. So we have over 100 primary care physicians, and we have several immediate care facilities as well. We have uh, facilities in Palm Springs, in Palm Desert, in Indio, and in Yucca Valley. And uh, this last year has obviously been a, a challenge for all of us, uh, but uh, we also offer now virtual visits with physicians so you can continue to receive your health care in a safe manner. And as you mentioned, Jack, uh, also vaccines are readily available at this point. It's very easy for anyone, uh, members or non-members, to be able to make an appointment and get a vaccine. Um, the easiest way to do that is to visit our website, which is mydohc, that's mydohc.com. When you get to the website, you'll notice the very first screen there has all of the COVID vaccine information. So with a couple of clicks, you can sign up and get a vaccine. Uh, we offer vaccines at our campus in Palm Springs and also in Indio. So it's very simple to do that. We also are offering vaccine clinics out in the community, as, as you mentioned. Uh, over this past year, we've been pleased to be able to purchase a brand new mobile unit that we take out into the community. Uh, this mobile unit allows us to do vaccine clinics and much more. We're able to do screenings on site, uh, for example, blood pressure screenings, um, body mass index screenings, glucose screenings um, in a safe and uh, patient friendly environment. I'm gonna share some photos of our new mobile unit so people can actually see what the mobile unit looks like. So hopefully you'll be able to see that in a second here. There we go. So there you can see our unit. And what's great about this unit is uh, there's a lot of areas in the valley that are underserved uh, with medical services. So we're able now to take our mobile unit out into the community wherever the need is the greatest. And we're able to provide screenings. We're able to provide one-on-one -on -one consultations uh, with physicians as well. So we can take this out into the community. It sets up easily and it's very comfortable. There's two exam rooms in there. Uh, it is also wheelchair accessible. We have a ramp as well. There's a restroom on board. So we are fully equipped and this really helps us expand our services out in the community and also for health fairs. You know, we've done the Jocelyn Health Fair for many years and we provided screenings there. Now we're able to do the screenings in a dedicated environment, which will make it a lot more comfortable for all of us, for the patients, as well as the staff. So we're looking forward 
to doing that and working with you with the unit as well. So that's it in a nutshell. Uh, we're looking forward to uh, working with you. Uh, we do have vaccine clinics as well. I know you have one coming up tomorrow. We have one coming up tomorrow as well over at uh, La Quinta High School. Um, you can make an appointment or we're also accepting walk-ins. So uh, if you still need a vaccine, please visit our website and we'll get you set up as soon as possible. And uh, again, thank you to the Jocelyn Center for all you do. Uh, we'll look forward to working with you and hopefully this year come um, Medicare Advantage open enrollment season, we'll be able to be there on site again and uh, provide seminars to help your members make the right choices during open enrollment season. Well, I want to thank you, Felice, for, for updating us. And those, those pictures of your mobile unit look great. Um, and we're looking forward to the opportunity of having that mobile unit here on site for your members and for uh, Jocelyn members to get wellness checks. Uh, uh, and with our upcoming, um, hopefully later in the, in the fall, our, our fall health fair, um, and we really appreciate the collaboration and partnership we have with Desert Oasis Healthcare and the support that you provide, um, not only to the Jocelyn Center, but to seniors throughout the Coachella Valley. And um, congratulations on your um, 40th anniversary. Um, as I mentioned before we started, I think we share a 40th anniversary um, here at the Jocelyn Center with you. So. Um, the, the uh, good vibes of the universe came together in 1981. <laughs> um, and, and two great organizations arose from that time. So um, I really wanna thank you um, for taking some time with us. We, again, we appreciate your support. Uh, and for those of you that were watching, just, just to let you know, it may have been a little slow getting us started. Um, uh, Zoom changed their, uh, procedure for getting onto Facebook. <laughs> so it took me a minute to figure it out um, on the fly. So uh, I apologize for any delays in our in our broadcast today. Um, uh, but now at least I have it figured out. So we will um, see you next time. Have a great weekend and uh, watch for the jo Jocelyn Variety Show on Monday uh, at 11 a.m. Uh, and that will be uh, um, another great show. So Thank you again, Felice, and everyone, you, Felice, you. and everyone watching, have a great weekend. Um, thank you, Jack. Thank you.